Welcome to the support videos for workload automation video series. This video will demonstrate how to resolve a control M variable or auto edit with PREV as an expression value using the control M service CTM VAR utility. The variable with expression value PREV is only relevant when used with a job that is being ordered, as this variable is to find the previous scheduling date of the job. That means this variable only returns the previous system date when it is used with a daily scheduling job. For example, if the variable with the expression value PREV is not used with any job, and now we run CTM VAR action set VAR double percentage backward slash PREV VAR EXPR double percentage PREV to set a variable PREV with the expression value PREV. The result shows the expression value is empty. If the variable with the expression value PREV is used with a job that was scheduled to run every day, for example, job PREV1 has global variable PREV1 with the expression value PREV defined in the job definition and was scheduled to run every day. This job just completed today, on the 1st of January 2019. Now we run CDM VAR action list. Look for variable PREV1. The result shows the expression value is the previous scheduling date of this job, the 31st of December 2018, which is just the previous system date. We can see the current system date is the 1st of January 2019. If the variable with the expression value PREV is used with a job that was scheduled to run on specific days, for example, job PREV2 has the global variable PREV2 with the expression value PREV defined in the job definition and was scheduled to run on the 1st and the 25th of each month. This job just completed today on the 1st of January 2019. Now we run CTM VAR action list and look for the variable PREV2. The result shows the expression value is the 25th of December 2018, which is the previous scheduling date of this job. That concludes this Control M Solutions video. The Workload Automation Support Team looks forward to helping you if any assistance is needed.